sun is rising, here we are I didn't think we'd come this far I just feel it This is truly where I belong Making my way down Ocean Drive Hungover people pass me by I know they feel it Yeah, they feel the way that I do right now Lost in Miami and we were too drunk But it was only you and I What's going on everybody, today we are going to be looking at the One UI 2.0 launcher for almost any Android 10 supported devices. Note that it does require root and magic working. The launcher here itself is super smooth and everything is working quite well. But I can't guarantee you whether it would work perfectly on your device or not. For me personally, I am using Lineage 17.1 on my Galaxy J7 2015 and it works perfectly. You can just run through the settings by yourself where you can just customize your app grids, orientation and so on. But the launcher here is pretty responsive. Feels like I'm using a 90 hz display. Don't get me wrong, I'm just saying it's kind of an expression. Yeah, also I will be providing all the necessary files in to install this launcher and get this launcher working on your device. So go ahead and download all the files given in the description below and follow my steps carefully thereafter. Now let's enjoy the video. Broken bottles on the floor. We were still drunk from the night before. We didn't care if we didn't care if there was snow tomorrow. But under the floor of the sunset we danced and it was only you and I. So to install One UI Home on your device, you need to have Magisk installed. You can find that Magisk zip in their official webpage. Then head over to Recovery and flash Magisk as shown in the video. Then you have to download one APK naming One UI Home and a file named Quick Switch. Then open up the Magisk and tap on the three dot menu on the upper left corner, tap on modules, then tap on the orange plus button, open the quick switch zip with your desired file manager and then flash and reboot. Once your phone has been booted, just open up the Magisk application and see if the quick switch module is installed or not. Once you have done that, then install One UI Home APK but don't open it. Open quick switch, give it the root permission, tap on the One UI launcher, tap OK and it will automatically reboot your device. Once your device is booted up, select One UI Home as default launcher and you are good to go. So here it is how you can install the One UI 2.0 launcher on your device. See you in my next video. Enjoy.